We are gonna do some upgrades. I'm gonna let Dex do it for Scrappy's motorcycles. And they are some unbelievable upgrades. It's physics, math, and engineering. Machine it, draft it, build it, test it, break it. Every time something new gets built, the entire world advances. Laying in bed at night, it's designing new parts, designing new suspension, designing new wings. All right, guys, so this is gonna be a little bit different video, but I'm really excited because Dex is gonna head this up. Some of you have asked what's the latest with Scrappy. After we took it to Oshkosh, we had it there at the last Oshkosh. Quite frankly, after Oshkosh, I flew it home and within one week, the insurance came due. Now, unfortunately, I wrecked Draco, which made me very hard to insure. So my year of flying Scrappy was $50,000 in insurance. And I had to decide, am I going to re-up the next year of insurance and continue flying Scrappy while building a house, building the Red Bull airplane, building mine and my wife's Cub simultaneously, building another airplane we haven't talked about and doing an STC project on another aircraft we haven't talked about. Quite frankly, my plate was so full and I'm assuring our other seven aircraft and helicopters, um, it just didn't seem to make sense. I knew I would not have time to do much flying. So Scrappy is in perfect health, perfect shape, but horribly sad that it has been parked waiting for me to get done with our house, get done with the other aircraft, get back, turbocharge it and make some upgrades. But in the meantime, while we are electing to save the insurance money, which I will pay and bring it back <laughs> because I miss Scrappy a lot. But uh, while we're down waiting to finish all these other projects, we are going to do some upgrades. I'm going to let Dex do it because the motorcycles hanging under it. Apparently some of the motorcycle and forum on electric bikes got really um, enthusiastic. I was super excited to hear people talking about all over. We're carrying electric motorcycles on a solar winged aircraft scrappy that these super cool companies reached out and said, we want to send you some stuff for Scrappy's motorcycles. And they are some un believable upgrades and I got to tell you they sat in a box for a long time because I knew Scrappy was uninsured and unflyable while I finished the other projects however I opened them up and now I feel bad I've waited this long to upgrade the motorcycle check this out engraved Scrappy and custom colored the big motors for the motorcycles for Scrappy so it says Scrappy on it I further opened up the box because my son Dex is really into these bikes and wanted to do the upgrades. Look what else I just saw. I had no idea even the controller is custom done for Scrappy. So they sent us two complete kits for mine and Ron's motorcycles. Dex here is going to put them on, show you how it works for any of you that are into motorcycles. This is a really cool upgrade. So uh, we got a lot of planes underway, house underway. Dex, why don't you tell them who these companies are and what you're going to do and when we're going to try trying this out. Yeah, so right now we've got a Chai battery. Shout out to them getting that. We've got the KO motor combo with the KO Mark II motor. Those are going to be ridiculous. They're going to push ridiculous power. That battery is about 70 amp hours out of 60 volt. What's in here is 32 amp hours. We've got over double the range and way more power capability out of these motors. And they sent two kits for each bike. So. That's just awesome. And then, <laughs> so we got a shout out KO, Chai Battery, and then Grit Shift for shipping all of it. Uh, thank you, Grit Shift, who sent the package to us. Thank you for sending and participating and helping us do this. Thank you to all these companies. Thank you. We love you guys. Thank you for supporting Scrappy Aviation, our family, my son, Dex. You know what we got to do. <laughs> That's crappy. <laughs> Back to work. <laughs>
turning control around here. We've got these two. People have been tuning the stock motor to about 12 kilowatts of power for any of those wondering, which is pretty fast already. The stock controller, you're limited to about six kilowatts of power, so you have to upgrade it if you want to do anything to your Suron anyway. But with this combo, for any of those wondering, it's the KO factory spec. This controller and this motor will each be capable of about 35 kilowatts of power. There are people pushing about 100 miles out of these things. It's ridiculous. And then second of all, we've got our batteries here. We have our stock and our Chai battery. This battery with a bypassed BMS, you can do about seven kilowatts and it's got 60 volt, 32 amp hour. It's pretty good. This battery is 60 volt, 70 amp hour. We've got more than double the range. And this battery, you can do about 11 and a half kilowatts. It's not meant for the highest power output, but it's just meant for going as far as the eye can see. So let's get these all installed and do some testing. installed the KO combo on here. Holy crap! That bike, I'm hitting maybe 65 miles an hour limited by gearing. It is ridiculous and I haven't even had a chance to charge it up to 100%. I'm only running like 50% right now. That thing's a proper dirt bike now. So we still have this one stock. I haven't put the controller in it yet, but we're out here at the dirt bike track and thought we're going to do some side-by-side -side comparisons. Uh, so first we're going to race them while they're a little bit more charged. We're going to switch drivers or riders. We're going to race them again, just so you can kind of see a little bit of a difference. It's more for having fun. We're not trying to do exact numbers or anything, but then we're going to do some playing and you're going to kind of see a little bit of what this, uh, this combo will do. As you saw on this jump right here, this one's still stock. It was barely able to make it up. Now, I do believe the green wire's not cut. On these bikes, they have this thing uh, where they ship it with only three kilowatts of power. You cut this wire and it'll unleash it to five and a half. So do keep that in mind. All right guys, hope you liked that video. Mostly my son doing cool stuff with the motorcycles for Scrappy, which was just awesome. The guys who gave me the free components, thank you so much. It was like a great Christmas present. Christmas is right around the corner and I know I'm saying this before it's even Thanksgiving, but it's getting close. I'm bringing it up now because we want to give away more first flights, help people get their license or finish their license that are part way along the way. And to do that, we're selling our shirts, hats, gear to help people get into aviation. So I just want to throw out a quick reminder. If you thought about getting some shirts, scrappy gear, Draco gear, any kind of uh, shirts, hats, mugs, I don't know, whatever we have for Christmas, please do it now so that we can help get more people their first flight and introduction into aviation. We appreciate it. We love you guys. We got a lot more videos coming. House and aircraft. You guys know the drill. Back to work.